son of a <laughs>
during this year. It can be any year. So what is your favorite gift been? Um, last year I got to go to my first concert as my Christmas gift, so that was pretty cool. Wow. Yeah. What artist? Uh, we, got, we went to the Jingle Bash, so it was like a bunch of people. That's really cool. Well, mine wasn't as cool when I was a little kid. I wanted an Optimus Prime with the trailer, and my stepfather got it for me, so that was really cool for me. Yes. Not as cool as Addison's, but you know. No, it's just too cool for us. <laughs> What's her most memorable Christmas memory? Well, my most memorable Christmas memory was when, and this is not a good memorable one, but it's a, it's a little thing for, for kids, don't do this. I uh, snuck a peek at all my presents, opened them up like a little bit, and retaped them. No. My mom found out, and she's like, were you peeking at all your gifts? So guess who did not open presents that year? No, you. How old were you? I was like nine. Another like memory like that I really love was Every year, when we were little, yeah. little kids, go out and drive around and look at all the Christmas lights. Uh -huh. My my uncle, my grandpa, my cousins and I, I grew up with three boy cousins, and we would look for Rudolph. You know those towers that had the blinking red lights? Uh -huh. yeah, yeah. There'd be Rudolph. <laughs> so we would look for those, and then we'd get home from looking at the Christmas lights, and Santa had already come, and put oh, the yeah. presents under the tree. We all have pretty cool stories like Melissa's. If you have one, please share them in the comments down below. While you're here, there's so many great exhibits that you should check out. Like, why not imagine you're traveling somewhere fun? We're taking a trip with Maria in the boat. Yeah. <laughs> so wait, where are we going? Um, I think Bali. We're, we're sticking to Bali? <laughs> yeah, we're sticking to Bali and uh, we have Santos finally coming along. <laughs> it's going to be an awesome trip. Yeah, hey, you're doing this one. Oh. Check it out. What is that? Oh. Alright, so we have a head-to-head. -head. So right now the champion for axe throwing is Maria, hands down. But who is the better cow milker? to eat and dang that's a long hot dog moving on to fairy castles and man am I glad I had lunch before coming here Us right now. I don't know. I don't know how I feel about this. It's like body parts. <laughs> yeah, human body sandwich parts. I feel like it's like Gross. Halloween all over again. Some mustard, some, you know, lettuce, tomatoes. <laughs> Those are not turkey testicles. Those are not turkey, Carl. <laughs> Alright, so we had a lot of fun at the museum today and uh, I want to thank my friend Carl. What was your favorite part about today? I really like the Christmas trees and being able to see the different places from how people did it in Mexico, the Philippines, and Melissa just found the Netherlands. No, so, so that's pretty cool that you know you can kind of see how celebrating the same thing but just done in a different way. So yeah. that, was, that was my favorite part. Yeah, that was awesome. And I'm glad we were all here to be able to do it together. And with matching shirts. Yeah! <laughs> Elf in training. <laughs> we hope you enjoyed our little shenanigans at the museum. And don't forget to check out the Santos Chronicles channel. They are a fun family travel channel and they visit some unique and quirky places around the Midwest and beyond. Hope you guys enjoy an exciting holiday and thank you so much for watching. And as always, see you in the next one.